Welcome to this video that's going to teach you more about the outlaw archetype. If you're the kind of person who's committed to your own personal growth and understand that the introspective work you do on yourself can lead to out to success in all areas of your life and business, then you're going to love this series about the 12 archetypes. Hi, my name's Abigail. I'm an over 40 content creator and consultant, and I help other midlife women align their online identity with their inherent personal identity. I do that through content creation consultation based on personality archetypes and follow through all the way to photo and video production. When you have a deeper understanding of yourself, you're able to more easily recognize patterns of behavior, thought, emotion, and beliefs that both hinder and help your personal and professional journey. With this insight, you're able to course correct and realign the traits and characteristics that are authentically part of your inherent makeup. If you've ever felt like a square peg being jammed into a round hole and just not finding the fit, it's likely you're forcing yourself into someone else's idea of a desirable reality. In truth, we all have unique drivers and motivations that we're born with and all too often, due to a lack of awareness and understanding, we find ourselves pursuing an outcome we don't even want, simply because that outcome was presented to us as the only option. When you realize who you really are, it's easier to define what you really want and start taking steps towards a reality that aligns with your true nature. If you don't yet know your dominant archetype, be sure to pause this video and take my free archetype quiz. It'll take you about 10 minutes to complete and then you can hop back on here to finish this video with more clarity. If you've already taken the quiz and you know your archetype but this isn't the one, head to my channel, check out the playlist on the 12 archetypes and find the video relating to your dominant archetype. So without further ado, let's dig into understanding more about the outlaw archetype. The outlaw. Rebel. Game changer. Destroyer. The revolution is not an apple that falls when ripe. You have to make it fall. Ernesto Che Guevara. The outlaw is a non-conformist who challenges and changes mundane and antiquated rules. You don't trust people who continue to do things a certain way just because that's the way they've always been done. You feel trapped and repressed if you're expected to conform and you welcome change if it means letting go of your own limited beliefs and habits. The part of you that's an outlaw breaks rules and challenges tradition. An outlaw is suspicious of anyone who does things as they've always been done, or those who do what everyone else is doing. Outlaws are suffocated by convention. The noble side of an outlaw is guided by a vision of a brighter future that opposes the selfish agendas of those in authority. The outlaw will not accept compromise for themselves or others, and they make changes quickly, not eventually. The outlaw in you tends to notice and pay attention to viable threats and the solutions offered in response to those threats. Outlaws make it their mission to eradicate injustice and incompetence by bringing the need for radical change and innovation to the attention and knowledge base of others. They may fall prey to anger and outrage, which sparks action in those who are otherwise accustomed to the status quo. Either that or they start a revolution. The plot that predominates when you live the outlaw story is much like an excision of something malignant. Outlaws are triggered by any actions that suggest any form of suppression of people or causes. Outlaws unveil the blocks and threats to growth and progress and set about removing them in whatever way is necessary. They'll break laws or sidestep rules if they find that those rules are found to be unreasonable. A mature outlaw excels at ridding themselves of their own limiting behaviors as a means to drive positive change. Activities and tasks fulfilling to an outlaw involves eradicating outdated inefficient systems and canvassing others to join their causes. They take great pleasure in effecting change and yet they derived just as much fulfillment from disrupting the status quo, being a thorn in the side of the bureaucrats or bringing awareness to the cause. The part of you that's an outlaw finds happiness facing the threats that others fear and find fulfillment in leading their charges out of the dark and into the light of a better way of life. Outlaws don't fear the unknown and therefore appreciate the process of life and death. My hope is that after watching this video, you've got more clarity about the outlaw archetype. Remember, if you don't yet know your archetype, please be sure to go and do my free quiz over at abigailk.com forward slash quiz. This video will resonate a lot more when you know which archetype is your most dominant. If you'd like to learn how you can use personality archetypes to express your personal brand with more clarity and confidence, check out my class on Skillshare. And now over to you. Let me know in the comments three ways in which you're going to start intentionally expressing your dominant archetype. That could mean changing the way you dress or the jewelry you wear. Or perhaps you're going to take up a new hobby that you've always wanted to do, but you felt others wouldn't approve. 
If it aligns with your archetype, start that hobby. Or perhaps you're ready to make the commitment or to change your lifestyle to bring it more into alignment with who you inherently are. I'm excited to see how this awareness transforms your life.